YouTube, what is up guys? My name is Jake and welcome back to a another video. I hope you're all having a fantastic week so far. Today's video is a setup video. I haven't actually done a setup video in like over a year or something. Well, okay, I gotta stop doing saying this whenever I'm doing something for a series that I haven't done in forever because pretty much all of my series that I've done on this channel so far have been done almost over a year ago obviously because before starting back up this channel and starting to upload again it was like a year gap a year hiatus so yeah obviously this video has not this type of video has not been done in almost over a year because I haven't uploaded in over a year but by the time you're watching this video, i like a month in now to uploading consistently, somewhat consistently. But yeah, all right, um, this is a setup video. Um, the last setup video I did was the Johnny Geiger setup video. Put a card up in this corner if you wanna go check that one out. That's actually probably my favorite setup video that I've ever done because the shots in that just insanely artsy. Uh, Elijah did a dope job filming that video. But yeah, that's probably my favorite one, although it has the least amount of views, which is kind of a bummer. So if you wanna go check it out, card up in the corner for you to click and then uh, enjoy with your eye holes. But for now, we're on this set of video. Uh, put you down right here. So my last board was a weekend board and I was skating that board for probably three weeks and then two days ago I just snapped the nose because the chip, the the nose, the plies were like splitting so it was super weak and it was really dumb. I ollied off a little one, little curb and I snapped the nose. But, but today's board I'm going to be setting up is a size 825 Hangar 94 shop deck. Um, because uh, I love the shape of their boards. Their concave is nice and steep, how I like it. The nose and tail are very distinctive, which is what I like. And uh, they're only 20 bucks. The last, I think, four boards that I've been skating have been all size 838, and they didn't have any 83s, and I need a board. Right now, I'm skating this old revive board from like three years ago that I've just kept around as a spare deck in case something like this happens I can have a spare to at least skate and hold me off until I get a new deck so thankfully I got a new deck but unfortunately it's an 825 so it is smaller than what I'm used to but it's fine I don't want to be complained too long in this video let's just get right into the setup
All right, well, this is kind of a, I feel like boring-ish setup video. Um, I don't, there's just really hard to get these angles here because I'm in kind of this weird spot with these, uh, this tree and stuff. So I figured I'll just, um, so I figured I'll just do a little story time, I guess. Uh, I'm gonna tell you guys the story of how my, like the situation and scenario between my board snapping because it sucked and it was kind of embarrassing. So I was, I had just got to the skate park. I haven't skated really all week. Uh, I'm on spring break, if you didn't know, that's why I'm in San Diego. So I've been kind of running around doing other things and not really having a whole lot of time to skate. So uh, that's why I haven't skated in about a week or so. So it was my first time skating in a while. And I went to go meet up with Elijah and our, our buddy Josiah. Just, you know, shred a little bit. Hit the skate park, whatever. It was fine. I'm warming up. I'm warming up my body. Doing some warm-up tricks. And, you know, I'm just alling down this, like, ledge. That's sick just to kind of warm up my legs and try and warm my body up and whatever. So I'm doing that. I've done it a few times. And like I said, my board has a crazy amount of splitting in the nose, which sucks. Okay, for some reason, my camera just stopped recording and I spent like three minutes explaining stuff and it didn't catch anything. So as I was saying before, I just looked at the clip, I was talking about how for some reason I have Allen Key Hardware and Everyone Skates Phillips. Uh, I, long story short, didn't see the problem in it. Got some, year goes by without an issue, whatever. Then uh, I'm skating the park uh, that I was at with Elijah and our buddy Josiah. And uh, dumbest way possible, I'll lean off a little curb trying to warm up, snaps my deck right, right on the nose. The nose just is gone, it's obliterated. Uh, probably because weekend is probably I don't, I don't know if it was my board only or all their boards are like this but dude they're just the wood was not put together very good in the plies and I'm sorry weekend but that just it blew I was only skating the board for like three weeks I skate my boards usually like a month or two so that it, it just blew you know it was a bummer but anyway uh, where was I saying after that, yeah, okay. So, I'm skating, board snaps, whatever. I have my spare one in my trunk, and then my buddy Josiah has a tool, so he goes and gets his tool for me to use while I'm grabbing the spare deck. Only problem is, once I get back to the park with my spare to set, up, set it up, I realized Josiah only has a Phillips head screwdriver. As you know, I have Allen key, so that's kind of a problem, you know? I kind of need a, an Allen key, not a Phillips head screwdriver. So uh, I think I'm screwed, you know, I'm not having the greatest day already. Um, I had, it was only like 30 minutes into the session, I didn't want to go back home because it was gonna take me like two hours to get back home because of traffic. So it just it it was it was a terrible situation all in all. The uh, the homies drove me to a skate shop that was only like five ten minutes away, and they had a toolbox with a bunch of Allen keys that I could use to um, I could use to set up my new board. And I just went back to the park and skated for another couple hours. So all in all wasn't the biggest deal just kind of annoying because well no one cares in Allen key so long story short I should probably switch back to Phillips although I like Allen key hardware so really I'm probably just gonna keep skating Allen key and just make sure to have my freaking uh, tool with me so in case that happens again I will have an Allen key. 
And I should probably, oh, trash is flying everywhere. I should probably get a better backup board now. I should probably retire this one because I, it's like three years old. It's been sitting in my trunk for the last like year or two. And I surf too, so it's like, after the sesh, I'll throw my wetsuit back there. So it's all wet and soggy. And it probably gets humid in my trunk. And it's, I don't know, this board has like no pop. It's super soggy. Moral of the story is I'm probably gonna get a new uh, backup board because this one sucks now. And um, maybe have a backup board that's actually the size I ride in 8.3 because Game used to a smaller deck, dude, all over again. It's like trying to learn how to skate. I don't, I don't get it. I don't get it, but whatever. Hopefully I can uh, skate pretty all right with this board. Uh, that's pretty much everything I have to tell you guys about the story. Um, I'll get back to you guys when I'm done setting up the board. There she is, a uh, little recap. Hangar 94 shop deck, Thunder 149 trucks, Wayward 52 millimeter wheels with bones red bearings, and mob grip and a blue curb skateboards sticker. Right now I'm going to go try and do the kickflip test, see if it's going to be a good board or not, and I'm not even in my skate shoes. So new board, not my size not wearing my skate shoes definitely gonna land kickflip first try but let's do it what holy crap i was not actually expecting to land that first try all right sick all right uh, that's basically it. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button, smash it if that's something that you feel like you want to do. I mean, I don't really know. Uh, do whatever you like. Uh, hit all the buttons, I guess. Uh, yeah, if you want to see more videos like this for myself, hit that sub boot button. Uh, we post videos. We, it's like I have a production company or something. It's only me that's doing any of the work. Uh, anyway, I completely lost my train of thought. Oh yeah. Uh, I post videos every Saturday at 12.30 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, and I love your faces. I hope you guys have a fantastic week, and uh, roll that outro. I'm sorry I didn't kiss you, but it's obvious I wanted to.